Meet the thinnest 4G LTE smartphone. The Droid Razor by Motorola proves that thin is not frail. With a scratch-resistant Corning Gorilla Glass face, a back made Kevlar strong, and a water-repellent nano-coating to protect against everyday spills. Carve through multiple tasks, media and downloads with a dual-core 1.2 GHz processor and 1 GB of RAM, and tear through the web at the supercharged speed of Verizon 4G LTE. Unleash the power of Droid Razor with the Motorola Lapdoc 100. Devour photos, videos and documents on a 10.1 inch screen. Take command of the web and email with a full Firefox browser and full-size keyboard. With mobile view, you can make and take calls. Send texts and use the full power of Droid Razor on the same screen. Customize your experience with the ever-expanding world of Android apps. With more than 500,000 apps in the Android market, there's an app for almost everything. Or take command of work and play with an army of apps already preloaded. Battle it out for gridiron dominance with NFL Mobile. Streamline your day and eliminate the mundane with smart actions. Set custom shortcuts and tasks like shutting down Wi-Fi to conserve battery, switching to silent at the theater, or automatically launching a playlist when headphones are detected. Use Motocast to wirelessly command music, videos, and documents from your computers to your Razer at the supercharged speed of Verizon 4G LTE. Launch the 8 megapixel camera directly from your lock screen so you can take more pictures in less time and switch to video to record in mind-blowing 1080p HD. Claim power over all that you survey with 1080p HD video recording and a brilliant 4.3 inch Super AMOLED advanced display. Then, use quick upload functionality to seamlessly share every detail online. Dock your phone in the HD station and get more than just a charge. Plow through email. Scour the web. With HDMI output, the dock takes over your HDTV and transforms it into a massive droid razor. Watch movies in full 1080p HD. Droid Razor. Too powerful to fall in the wrong hands.